Hey guys, this is Jillian here with Rika, the Belgian Malinois, and today we're going to talk about leash ball. Rika was really, really stubborn. She was very anxious in the beginning, and there are so many new smells, and she wanted to explore. We wanted to teach her how to walk alongside us calmly. If the dog is very confident, always pulling you with an overactive mind or a puppy that's learning, I always want to make sure that my step is always in front of your dog. This allows the dog to always understand that I'm the leader, I'm the, I'm the pack member here. If I'm like this or like this, I'm telling my dog, go ahead, you're leading my way. No point for me to move forward if the dog's not relaxed. focused on really, really short walks. Short quality walks over really long walks where she would get a lot of correction. Rika and I would do the same loop over and over again. That way she got more confident with it and knew what to expect. When we had the regular collar on or even the martingale collar, we found that she would really choke herself out. For safety reasons, we wanted to use the prong aside from teaching her correct leash walking. The prong collar was really helpful for her to realize that what she was doing, the pulling, was incorrect. So the prong isn't hurting Rika, it's just applied pressure. It needs to be fit correctly. You do that it's an extended hand. We're gonna tap it here, so no touch. See, she's walking ahead. Hey, hey, no. Nope. No. Nope. 